Hi everyone, welcome back to the Hybris Tube. Today video is super important. If you have ever struggled with the dependency errors in IntelliJ while working with the custom extensions in Hybris, then watch this video till the end. I will walk you step by step through how to fix these dependency issues. And when I say dependency problems, I mean when one extension, right, like here, it is training core extension, which is dependent on another extension. For example, I have created this class, right? This class has some of the class references from another extension called as inbound services, right? But IntelliJ or the hybrid build doesn't recognize it properly. So as you can see, guys, I have this hybrid to pre persist hook class and here we have four compile time errors right so these are the four compile time errors if you carefully see guys let's say first error right which is cannot resolve the symbol persistence context right here if i just try to see what exactly is this persistence context right here you can see guys this persistence context dot java class is one of the class right but it is present into the extension inbound services extension so this class is present into the extension inbound services extension but somehow my java class which is hybrid to pre persist hook dot java and is present into the training core extension right it is not able to recognize this persistence context class which is present into the inbound services extension so these compile time errors are one problem and the second problem is guys that we are also getting the build errors right when i do ant all right i am getting all all these errors as well so we are getting two type of error one is like IntelliJ which is my editor it is not able to basically recognize the classes which are present in any other extension second is I am also getting the build error which means hybris build is also not able to recognize those classes if I carefully see the first error what it is saying that it is saying that hybris to pre persist hook dot java right which is present into the training core extension right it is not able to recognize the it is not able to recognize this class persistence context class right so we are getting these two errors so let's see how we can fix both the intellij compile time error and hybris build errors together please ignore the logic which is written in this hybris to pre persist hook class because this is the topic for our next video here my intention is that i want to show you that how we can fix these dependency errors where one of the class present in one extension is using the classes which are present in another extension and this class is not able to basically you know recognize these classes which are present in another extension so for now we will focus on fixing these dependency issues and the compile time errors in the IntelliJ if you see here on the terminal the build is failing because it doesn't know where to find this persistence context class, right? But actually, as I show you, showed you that the persistence context is a part of the inbound services extension, right? Here, if I show you again, the persistence context, right? So this class is already the part of the inbound services extension. So why is this build failing? The reason is because this training core extension, so this training core extension, which you can see over here, right, it is not aware that persistence context belongs to the inbound services. That is why, you know, I am getting this build time error, right? So how do we inform this training core extension about this dependency that I am going to tell you now? So to do this, just open the extension info.xml of this training core extension, right? So currently I am telling you how to fix this build errors which are coming in the terminal, right? So what you have to do right so you have to go to the extension info.xml file of the training core extension and where is that extension info.xml file so you can see here we have this extension info.xml file here i have to tell 
that I also need the inbound services extension as the required extension. So what I have to do, I just have to basically do like this required extension name is equal to inbound services. That is what I have to do. Why I have written the name as inbound services, because if you see guys, this inbound services extension, if you see this inbound services extension, right? So this is basically my inbound services extension. If I open its extension info.xml file, and if I see over here, the name should be basically inbound services and this is the name which i am basically using into the extension in photo.xml of basically training core extension so you can see this is the name i am using over here i hope guys it is clear to you what i have done here and when i mention this entry guys now hybris build is aware right that okay we have the inbound services and hybris will will also be able to now recognize all the classes present into this inbound services extension right which means now if i build this project or if i fire this ant all command now these build errors should not come so i hope this is clear to you so basically this line tells hybris that training core depends on inbound services and it can now access all the classes from that extension when i mention this line including the persistence context which means when i will build my project now now hybris to persistent hook.java class this will be able to recognize this persistence context interface as well now let's try to build the project again and let's see after we have declared this line right in the extension info.xml whether the build error is still coming or the build will be successful this time so i'm firing the command and all and this time you will see that there will be no build errors so let's wait for the build to get completed So guys, you can see this time the build is successful, right? And you can see I have this, you know, Java class hybrid to pre persist hook dot Java, right? Which is present into the training core extension. And still you can see this is using the persistence context, right? And all these classes as well, which belongs to the inbound services. And my build is also successful. But guys, even though the build was successful, IntelliJ is still showing the compile time errors right intellij is still showing all those four compile time errors why it is happening because intellij doesn't automatically pick the dependency from the xml so intellij can't identify even if i declare this inbound services as required extension in the extension in photo.xml it can't identify this xml ma mapping we have to basically separately declare the dependency of inbound services extension on the training core extension because it has not added the inbound services to the project class path yet so that's where the project structure settings come into this picture and where is this project structure settings so you can see here we have this project structure right so this is one of the option in the intellij and to fix this intellij compile time errors to fix these intellij compile time errors what you have to do you just have to go over here and then you have to click on this project structure so you can see i'm clicking on the project structure right then guys you have to go to this modules option so you can see i am going over here then within the module option right now we have to basically add the dependency of inbound services on the training core extension right so what i have to do i have to basically select my extension so this was my extension right training core and here if you see the dependencies tab here currently we have just declared that training core extension is dependent on accelerator cms i have not declared that training core is dependent on the inbound services extension so how can i 
basically add the you know dependency of training core extension on the inbound services extension for that you just have to click on this plus icon so you can see i'm clicking on this plus icon and now i have to basically add the dependency of inbound services extension right so that's why i will just click on this module dependency i will just select the inbound services right i will just select the inbound services extension so you can see guys here i have this inbound services so i will just select it and i will just click ok right and then i will just click over this as well i will check this option and then i will click on this apply button so you can see i am clicking on the apply and then i will click on the ok and now you will see that those red errors have been vanished so i hope guys this is clear to you that how you can basically fix the hybris build issues right the build issues where one extension is dependent on another extension and how you can fix the corresponding you know compile time errors right where one of the class present in one of the extension is using the classes from another extension and the extension is not aware about the classes of another extension right i hope guys it is clear to you so what we have learned today or what we did today we created this custom hook class right you don't need to take care of the logic which is written in this uh, class because our intention was just to show you how we can fix the dependency errors right after that guys we also because this class is using the classes or interfaces of another extension right and it had the dependency errors right our build was failing right to fix the build error what we did in the extension info.xml of training core extension right i added this required extension right and when i added this then the build error got fixed and then finally we also basically resolved the intellij compile time errors via the project structure right and then going into the modules right and then going into the extension where those errors were coming and i added the extension on which this training core extension was dependent right and then i clicked on apply and i clicked on the ok button you also need to take care of one more important thing for example this is training core extension right and we saw that it is using one of the this extension is having one of the java class right like hybris to pre-persist hook.java right and it is using some of the classes which are present in another extension for example persistence context right this is present into the inbound services extension so you also need to take care that you declare this inbound services extension also into the local extensions.xml file for example we have declared this inbound services extension over here if you don't declare it then still you will get the build time errors even if you you know declare this extension as a required extension in the extension info.xml file so this is also very important point you need to take care so that's all i wanted to cover in today's video if you found this video useful please hit like and don't forget to subscribe to hybris for more tutorials like this and if you have any questions or got stuck somewhere please drop a comment below and i will try my best to help you out thank you for watching bye